Hello everyone and welcome back to another trek and thank you for joining me, Stock Trek Girl. And on today's trek, we'll be going over Rocket Lab's next launch, Love at First Insight, on November 11th, 2021. Now you may be wondering who exactly is Rocket Lab in love with that they are willing to commit to two back-to-back -back missions. I mean, that is some strong love right there. And the answer to that question is Black Sky. So Black Sky will be partnering as Rocket Lab's mate to be going up on this next launch here on November 11th from Mejia, New Zealand. Now, this launch is very meaningful because it is literally the first launch after the SPAC merger. So, before Rocket Lab was basically Rocket Lab, they were VACQ, and then they merged and they became RKLB on the stock market as their ticker symbol. So, since they've hit the stock market, they haven't quite had um, a launch, but now, here we go, the upcoming first launch for Rocket Lab, and it'll be interesting to see, you know, how this is going to affect the stock uh, on the following market day. Now, even though this will be the first launch since the stock uh, merged and came out, uh, it is the fifth launch for 2021. So even with Corona and all the issues that have been going on, they've still managed to get rockets up. Unlike some other people I know, I'm not saying no words, but I think you know who I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this is also gonna be Rocket Lab's 22nd mission overall. Now, I know how excited you all are about the whole helicopter coming in and catching the rocket and taking it away to be reused. But instead, what Rocket Lab is planning on doing is they are going to have a helicopter nearby the scene in order to watch the descent, gather their data, get, get the information and analytics that they need for future upcoming aerial catches. So they are going to be using the data. They are going to be still having a helicopter nearby. It's just not going to quite catch it, this launch. What they will be doing is a splashdown mission, meaning they are going to have a helicopter uh, nearby in the vicinity that will be watching the descent for future upcoming missions. So in this particular mission, expect the rocket to come splashing down in the water where they will bring a boat and come pluck it out and recover and send it back to that facility for a reusable small satellite rocket. Uh, for this launch, they just wanted to make a splash. So it'll be fun. It'll still be a fun watch and it'll be great to see them uh, recover and reuse the rocket for future missions. After all, after this launch, they do have an upcoming 23rd launch that they are also doing for Black Sky. So again, you know, the reusability factor and the turnaround time factor is going to be absolutely amazing for two of these launches right here, right now, in November. Now, you may be wondering, what exactly is Love at First Insight about? Well, let me tell you what. It, it's, it's quite a story, right? So, Rocket Lab, they met this really, really good-looking data and analytics you know, company uh, named Black Sky. And, you know, they kind of been dating for a while. They've been on a couple missions together. And uh, I don't know, you know, they they really hit it off. From what I hear, they, they fell in love at first insight. So, and, and and that's what this launch is all about. They, they fell in love. Yeah, no, not really. But basically, um, what they're doing is they are deploying the eighth and the ninth satellite into Black Sky's constellation. Now, why this is so important and crucial for Black Sky is because this is going to increase Black Sky's ability to do their revisits, meaning they capture an image from space, you know, and they'll be able to recapture the same location 
much faster for their clients so that they can get more real-time data a lot quicker and more efficiently than before with less satellites. So the ever-building constellation for black um, sky is definitely going to increase you know, their revisit rates, it's going to increase their data, and it's going to make their customers very, very happy. Not only that, but black sky is used to deliver real-time insights from above. So basically, I believe, you know, with Rocket Lab, uh, you know, launching them, that is pretty much why they call it love at first insight. So I have to shout out to the Rocket Lab team that is doing these mission patches, that, that's creating these titles for these missions because they're so unique, they're so creative, and I absolutely love it, you know, and I, I just love their creativity in this company. So you see this creativity and you have to know that there is some awesome people working there. Awesome, awesome people, you know, fr fr from the people that create the mission patches to the people that, you know, are working on the satellites and the components to the people that are even, you know, working behind the scenes that, you know, we really don't hear much about. I really do appreciate everything that they all do because that whole team as a collective is what makes Rocket Lab great. It, it makes it what it is today. So uh, congratulations to everyone at Rocket Lab for doing an awesome job. And to all of you who are looking forward to watching the launch on 11.11, be sure to check out the live stream link uh, that I included in the description below. And that is going to take you directly to Rocket Lab's page uh, that's going to have the live stream. But just remember, uh, the live stream will not be happening until T minus 20 minutes to launch. So uh, I made it easy for you. you don't have to go search all over, you know, freaking out last minute, where is the launch, you know? Um, you can find it in the description below or any other way you may want. Also, feel free to follow me on Twitter under Stock Trek Girl. And that way, you know, if you want to get more information in between videos and, you know, you want to send little tidbits about the upcoming launch or, or share something fun with the Stock Trek community on Twitter. And until next time, live long and prosper.